guys how are you how are you doing mama bear in the village i am doing some cleaning here at the cow shed mm, tell me how do i look <laughs> Jesus. okay i'm doing some cleaning and then i show you how we do biogas because that is the one we use to cook in the village so come along with me and say hi to my friends my cows <laughs> okay so cleaning we do it like this you see this thing i don't know how we call it but we use it to clean so you push the cow down like that you cow please don't hit me you you dare hit me hey. so you push like that I should be having some gum boots, but again, I don't know where they went. The last time I was here is a long time ago. So, uh huh. So you push like that. I hope you can see, Mama Bear. Hey, Mama Bear. Mm, okay. Ugali in the morning and lunch time. By the way, that is the order of the day in the shags. Ugali and a lot of it. Otherwise, you can't make it without Ugali. You need a lot of muscles. Yeah. Oh my god. We like it here. but there is no water as at now so you're supposed to like because you'll be washing with the water which is not there the, the piped water has stopped coming for like an hour it's unfortunate but again it's supposed to be watery so by the time it's coming here it will just go by itself like that okay and if it can't go you assist it to go so See you on the other side. <laughs> so guys, when you remove the, what do you call it? The cow dung, the one that I showed you, it's unfortunate there is no, there was no water at that moment. So it's not being um, flowing by itself. So when it comes here, you know, um, this place, you have to koroga koroga like this, eh? Hmm? Okay. Then when you, uh, you're finished, you remove this fodder. What do we call it? The remains. There are so many. Like, if it's possible, when you're, when you're doing the, the cleaning on the other side, you remove them, these things. Because now they are the ones that are, that are going to block. So you remove them. You can use this, that thing um, that looks like a fork. We call it a fork. Whatever. So you can use it, it's a big one, you can just scoop with it. Alternatively, use make do with what you have. Apparently that one has been broken. It's in the uh, Smith, Smith, what, that one. So you remove these things, and then, assuming now you're through with removing, and you see now it's watery, like you can see. It's watery, like that. So there's two ways to make this uh, cow dung go that way. So you can do such a thing 
and scoop it like this and then you put it inside here like that okay like that yeah this is clean work or clean work huh anyway uh, apart from that when you're sure you've removed everything you can lift show them this thing you can lift this this uh, pipe so that it goes by itself but make sure that you have removed everything all this residue all this from there now the it's going to pass through this this pipe it's going to pass through this pipe all the way to another place that i will show you in a bit so guys you see that pipe now that one is coming all the way from the place that i've shown you and then it comes to this this round uh, thing so you can show inside this is why it comes now from here remember by the time it's coming here okay go back so that now you show me uh by the time it's coming here it's watery and it doesn't have a lot of residue so when it's a lot it's because right now it's not a lot but when it's a lot it will just go and get inside this this hole can you see the hole so but when it's low like now you can just assist using such a thing or whatever you can use from your side and then you just get it and put it inside there mm -hmm. like that are you liking the video so far let me know on the comment section uh hit the like comment subscribe and show love to mama bear mm? you see how i love you i am more in fact i'm showing you how to save money don't go buying gas when you're living in the village this is what we are going to do mama bear is about saving money and just doing excellent work so from here inside here around here there's a very big hole that has been uh, that has been has been dug so it's coming from that side coming all the way and then by the time the machine now inside here there is a machine by the time the machine is uh, through with its work the gas gets inside here mm -hmm. so you see from there to here okay come just come and show them this is where the machine now for for gas is now this place there's supposed to always be some water and the water i think it's for cooling for making the you know when the gas is inside there because it's like um a, a container inside like the, the space inside okay just show here this is um inside here there is a there's just a stone it's stone but this place you're supposed to fill with water it's unfortunate this water looks is bad i'm supposed to like remove it and clean the place because the water is supposed to be clean all the time but like i said we've not been around for a long time and that is the work that i will do after today it's already evening so that is my tomorrow's work mm -hmm. so you clean this place and then you put water i think the water is to make the gas just compress and from there just come along from there it will go through the pipe the piping is here all the way to the house then the waste the waste now when it comes from here it goes here show them this other side this is where the waste goes let me show them this this is what you use when it comes and uh, and it feels like it's a bit heavy you can just use such a thing to Koroga, koroga, upate nguvu. You know, just to start like this. You start like this. And then it goes on the other side. And then, like, like you can see, it's a bit low. It's supposed to be up so that it fits here. Can you see this? That one, eh? That hole. That hole. It goes like that. And then it goes down on the other side. 
so we were doing some removing of the of the manure so that like you can see the crops down there they're so green and looking so healthy because of organic um fecal matter mm -hmm. so come along and show them where it goes from here it goes on that other side it goes down there yeah so after the the fecal the the dung the cow dung is from that other side and it comes here then all the way to this side and then like you can see the veggies the maize the fruits the everything looking so fresh and organic okay so let us see from there what happens to the gas because you are not talking about the you are not talking about uh the dung we were talking about the biogas so let let us go and see exactly where the gas now happens like you can see on this side it's already coming in i don't know if you can see here we have put a pipe water has just come oh god why did you just come when i finished cleaning the oh anyway now the water we are adding here is to make sure that this uh, this uh whatever it's it's um very easy and soft so that it can just pass on the other side so i hope until there we are together let's go see where the gas is going so guys when the gas comes from the place i showed you this is the pipe that it comes then it goes up of course serves other houses and then it goes through this um pipe and then all the way all the way it gets in through that pipe the pipe you can see down there to inside the house you can see now when it comes from down there this is the pipe now we connect it to the cooker and we are cooking so this is our tea like you can see so Thank you so much guys for watching remember to like give it a thumbs up comment share subscribe let me know what you think about mama bear in the village mm? what do you think what do you think <laughs> so guys let me know what you cook using how you do how do you do it in your um country in your village do you use biogas is it something you think you can do is it something you think you can utilize is, is it something you've learned from mama bear instead of wasting all that cow dung it's something that you can make profit from because guys guess what when i come to the village i'm not about to buy gas i'm about to utilize the resources that i have and cook for you and you eat and feel your bellies and feel good so thank you so much god bless you bye bye Mwah. cheers <laughs>